Hello friends, welcome to LMS Solution Research Support. In this video, we are going to discuss about three important uh, ChatGPT AAPRM prompts. So, where that prompts can be very very useful for our research article preparation. Those who are doing research and the people who are working for projects can uh, uh, very useful for can be very useful from this uh, AAPRM prompts. Hope this video will be very useful for you. So please do watch the full video. First we will go to ChatGPT. So first what I am going to do is I am going to open ChatGPT. So in that search box, in that search box you have to type conclusion. Conclusion. So type that conclusion. So after that you will be getting around 34 prompts. This prompts may increase uh, up to day by day therefore you have to uh, note make a note of the prompts uh, what I am going to give so first one what is what is the prompt is that so go on to next page so here you can see intro and conclusion writer this is an important prompt where you will get intro and conclusion for that particular topic so click on intro and conclusion so here what I am going to do is I am going to go for uh, that is research scholar so in this research scholar I have typed a grid connected PV system so randomly I have uh, chosen this closed loop control and performance evaluation reduced to part count multi-level inverter interfacing so like that I have selected this paper randomly so what I am going to do is I am going to open chat GPT again So here I am going to copy and paste the particular title which is obtained from Google Scholar going to give enter. So this uh, prompt will generate introduction and uh, conclusion for the particular topic you have given. So here our introduction is start to generate. So let us see. So here you can see the introduction part and you can see the conclusion part. So the word count is around 298 words. This may increase or decrease according to the topic you have given. So this is one of the very important prompt where you can generate the introduction. So this thereby you can use this introduction part in your research article preparation. So and also you will be getting the conclusion. If you are struggling to write the number, increase the number of uh, words in your thesis, you can use this kind of option to make uh, improve your content uh, technically. So this is uh, an important option in this prompt. So next prompt is that in the second page itself, you will be getting 100% unique holistic SEO human written article. So here there are many 100% uh, prompt like this will be given. So please make a note of it. Here you can see also 100% human written article blog post. So that is not the one. Here you can see 100% unique holistic SEO human written article. So this is the prompt here. What I am going to do is I am going to type uh, explain about the operation of a boost converter so like that so uh, why I am given chosen this topic boost converter is that most of them will uh, use the boost converter this is a common content uh, let us see how it will generate unique content related with that particular prompt because so boost converter is a general topic where uh, many of them use a common content so let us see so for that common content you can use this kind of prompt to uh, generate a unique content using this 100% unique holistic SEO human written article so after that I am going to click here so it will start generating it will take, uh, take several seconds
here you can see that our content is generated a boost converter is a uh, this is the to topic this is the basics of a boost converter a boost converter is normal step up converter is a dc to dc converter that increases the output voltage level from input voltage level like that it will generate and it will explain the several key components in that uh, boost converter first one is a switch that is a mosfet second one is a inductor second one is and the third one is a diode capacitor and the load so next one uh, you can see the modes of operation of a boost converter so this is a boost converter operation on state off state operation so like that you can generate the content and you can use this in your research article preparation so if there is any uh, say, same thing which is already which is already made a sentence is available you can make use of any paraphrase option to change that particular sentence itself so this is also an important option in this aaprm prompt so next important prompt is that give on next no trait tired or overused phrases so stop using overused phrases chat gpt avoid trite words and phrases overused phrases make your writing appear glitched unoriginal and lacking in creativity use fresh language make your writing more interesting so this is the prompt i am going to give so i am going to you the same topic explain the operation of boost converter like that i am going to give so here you can see how it will generate the content let us see in this you can see uh, a boost converter is an electronic circuit used to step up or increase the voltage level of dc power source here in that previous thing we have uh, seen that a boost converter is a dc to dc converter that is a traditional way of representation is given here you can see the phrases are different when compared with the uh, last one so you can see a boost converter consists of several key components and inductor a diode capacitor and a switch so like that it will the phrases uh, is uh, different from the normal phrases used in the uh, common contents so therefore you can use this option to redu reduce plagiarism and also you can make unique content using this aprm prompt so these are the three important prompts of what we have discussed today that is intro and conclusion next one hundred percentage holistic human written seo content next one third one is that uh, uh, this is new phrases no trade uh, so tired or over use the phrases hope this three prompts will be very useful for you researchers so hope this video will be helpful for you thank you for watching our videos thank you for your support please do subscribe and like uh, this video if you are interested so thank you for watching our videos have a nice day thank you